Sonny. I've always liked you. I think you're a great actress. I also know you're cool. You're from Boston, right? Chicago. Chicago, it's right. It's close, though. But you shut down Robbie backstage. Give it up, right? Yeah. <laughs> a silly woman. Yeah. I don't, I don't know him. I didn't know yeah. what to say. He was offended. Good job. <laughs> All right. What he doesn't know is we spent last weekend together. See, he doesn't remember. Yeah. Yeah, we, that's what it is. We're at the same hotel. Weird? In New York, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, I didn't bring it up. Don't, don't. No, I'm don't. nervous. No. Uh, <laughs> now, listen. They say that a lot of things are going well for you right now. Your career, you're working like crazy. Yeah, I'm happy. And then, this is the, these are the three things. You, you're work, you, you have a great, you have a romance in your life? I have some romance. You're working, your romance, and then, and then you moved. You have a new place to live, right? Yeah, I just bought a house. I moved to California. I've been in New York up until now. Wow. I think California is really good if you stay away from Beverly Hills. What's, what's wrong with Beverly Hills? Beverly Hills is one of the most frightening places in the entire world. Now, I may agree with you, but tell me why. Tell me why. Uh, maybe it's because I'm from New York. I, you walk down the street, yeah. right, and you see something in front of you that appears to be maybe a hot 20-year-old woman, miniskirt, yeah. big blonde hair, yeah. tan, and it turns, and it's 90. Oh. <laughs> and it's all stretched out. And like, woo! That's good, yeah. They yeah. do... They want to hang on to their youth as long as they can. There's a lot of plastic surgery victims lot, yeah, roaming yeah. around, and they twirl down Rodeo Drive. Right. <laughs> the thing about L.A. that I'll tell you, see, L.A. is like a spa. It's a wonderful resort. And then New York's like a crowded elevator. I mean, <laughs> I live there. It's the greatest city in the world, but the lifestyle is easier out here in L.A., so you're going to get a kick out of it. Yeah. Do you think it's that it's a healthier lifestyle, or do you think people just go to the plastic surgeon more? Well, no, no. I think with the, the weather, the sunshine, it's nice. I think you exercise more. And I just think, uh, I know that uh, the food, I think they eat healthier. They eat all the yogurt and sprouts out here. Not yeah. all for L.A. I'm so happy I made the move. I yeah. resisted it for a long time, and I'm having yeah. a really Let's good... talk about the guy. So, um, <laughs> who's the guy? He's uh, uh, not in the business. That's concert. smart. Cool. He's yeah. down to earth. He is, and he's smart. And Unemployed? He's, uh, no, he's got a job. He's got a job! <laughs> and yeah, I, I think he got in there because, you know, he was, uh, he was really hard to get. He played hard to get. Oh, how did you mean? I him? thought that was a chick thing. Yeah, I thought yeah. so too. Yeah. Um, I was doing this movie yeah? that, that I'm promoting, The Which In-Laws. The In-Laws, the, the remake, yeah. And we went out, and I, I, I had to go back to work, and I it, called him up on the phone, and we were supposed to go out that night, and he hung up on me and was in a bar and never called back. And I was like, who is this guy? And it, he was playing hard to catch. Oh, did that work, then? It, it works. I oh. mean, it's, it's hard on the chick, but it works. Yeah. So how long have you been going out with him? Nine months or so. So I have to hang up on a girl that I like? I, that's rude. I have to say, I asked, you know, I... I, I Dennis Free and I'm working with him. I know he's, he He's knows an old friend you. of ours. Yeah. And he told me, you know, I hope you're not planning on dating him because you're too old for him. Ah. Something like you like children. No, Farina, I, I showed up once with a, yeah. That, we don't need to, I don't need to hear this. <laughs> Stop it. You're a kid. No, he, he, that's his joke. Yeah, he, he said I was over 21. Yeah, I, that's his little joke. Okay. Knock it off, Farina. Are you mad? No, 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 that's fine. How's he doing? He's great. Yeah, he's good people. Yeah, he's a very funny man. God, can he drink. And <laughs> why, why remake the classic of the in-laws? The original had, of course, the, what, Peter Falk and, and Alan Arkin, right? Yeah. You know, it was really stressful. At the beginning, all my friends that are film snobs, they acted like it was sacrilegious. Yeah. Like, how could you remake that movie? It's genius. Yeah. And luckily, Albert Brooks came aboard because, you know, he's got he credibility. He carries some weight, yeah. He's an icon. Yeah. And he is incredibly funny, and he's great in the movie. And I like to say that it was kind of inspired by the original. It's not a remake. Okay. It's not word for word. And it's actually so nice to be able to promote a movie you actually think is funny. Oh, yeah, that's good, because sometimes you promote, or not you. A turkey. I yeah, promoted other people some turkeys. Will promote crap. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can say that out loud. Yeah. Uh, how was Michael Douglas? He's great. I heard you took a cheap shot at Michael Douglas. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, I, 
do martial arts in the film, uh -huh. and I train for a pretty long time, and right. I got in shape. Yeah. And uh, I was doing kickboxing, and I uh, was doing a scene with him. And now he's like 90 years old, so this is dangerous. <laughs> be careful. He's also really connected. I mean, there's some actors out there you could hurt in a scene, and it's okay. Yeah. You know, I was, I felt like I was seconds away. I tagged him so hard in the leg I was supposed to miss, and I tagged him. I thought I was going to be whatever happened to Robin Tunney. Right, Do you know right, what I mean? Right. Like. She used to work, right? She was in movies. So, so you went and you were supposed to fake kick him and you caught him in the thigh or something? In the shin. In the harder shin. than I'd ever kicked anything wearing wooden shoes. Oh, my Lord. Oh. Yeah. So, so what did he do? He had to freak out. You want to know what? What did he do? He's a stud. He, he was like, that didn't hurt. <laughs> yeah. And I don't know if he was being a gentleman about it and wanted to make me feel better yeah. or if... Maybe he just didn't want to be hurt yeah. by a 105-pound woman. Yeah. But either way, it's, it's okay. I'm employed. I didn't get fired. So you were impressed with that? Yeah, I was impressed with him. The man yeah. is so... I got to think, really, hang up on the girl, and then when they kick you, don't respond. Just kind of sit there. These are all manly things. You like the macho guys, right? Yeah, I like macho. He's, he's like... No wonder you didn't like Robbie. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. You know, you know what they say about the English? They're the quickest to pop on a dress. Exactly. Every, every British man wears a dress. You're absolutely right. We're out of time. The In-Laws opens Friday, May 23rd. Great to see you again. So Good nice job. To see you. Robin Tunney.